Hey guys, this is Lennon here for Visionary Universe, and today we're going to be doing something pretty luscious. All right, so basically we have this like a vibrant particle simulation here, whatever you want to call it. A lot of times you just want to switch the hue and see how it looks, and then you know you can be doing something with lightning, whatever it is. A lot of times it's just nice to switch the hue and see how it looks with different colors. So but this process actually turns out to be a little more complicated than it may seem to appear at first. So you might okay. So let's create an adjustment layer and let's try to shift the hue of this uh, particle simulation. So we go to this uh, add a hue and saturation effect and go to the master hue and just start switching this around. Let's see how this looks. So, so when we go to the red, something something really disgusting happens. See, this is how it's supposed to look. All right. So we have these yellow highlights. And then the mid tones are orange, and then these deep red uh, shadows. So that all looks amazing right there. But then when we just shift the hue from, from when starting from blue and just shifting it to red, something disgusting happens. And basically, what's happening is it's switched around. See now here the the shadows are more yellow, and then the highlights are pink, and that, that's disgusting. All right. So today we're talking about how to fix that. So it's actually pretty simple. Let's delete this hue and saturation effect, and what we need to do is type in invert. So we're going to apply this to the adjustment layer and okay this inverts the effect so what we need to do is go here to the invert effect go to the channel and then change this to hue all right so now it's just going to invert the hue and we're going to talk about a little more later about what what inverting the hue really does so now that we inverted the hue then we can add a hue and saturation effect and then here's when the magic happens now when we change the hue to our preferred color Boom, that looks amazing. Now we have the perfect yellow highlights with those deep red shadows. Awesome. Now you can just lusciously stare at this for, you know, whatever. So another way to do this is actually just solo the invert effect and change this from hue to that thing right there. All right. And this parameter actually gives a pretty visually stunning picture too because it has the perfect highlights. And, and we're going to talk a little more about how, how what the science behind how all this works. So imagine this is your highlights, this is your midtones, and this is your shadows, all right? So you have this, you have this red look, all right? So your your highlights are more yellow, your midtones are orange, and your shadows are more of this deep red, all right? So that's how you want it to be. Well, suppose you want to shift this all the way to the blue. So let's go ahead and rotate the hue. Basically, rotating this is like rotating the hue. And let's just rotate this all the way over there to the blue. But there's a see. The, here's where the problem is. See now the shadows of the cyans, the bright cyans. The midtones are the, the average blues, and these highlights are the deep violet indigo blue, and that's what that's what makes the effect look disgusting. Because it needs to be the opposite of that. So what happens when we add that invert effect? Is it basically just flips it? When we invert the effect, it just flips it like this. So now when we rotate it back around, when we change the hue, now it's perfect. See these highlights are in the cyans, and then the the shadows are in the violets. So that's when it really looks good. So yeah, the trick was when we Invert it, just flip the hues like this, and that allowed us to position the hue in the right place. So that's kind of science about how this works. All right, guys, I hope you found this helpful. That's a pretty sweet technique when working with hues, and hopefully, you know, you have a better understanding about how all these hues and different highlight colors work. Whatever. All right, see so if you guys could leave a like, that would be great. And uh, hey, consider subscribing to Visionary Universe. It's been fun, guys. I'll catch you in the next video.